empowering every family for time and eternity. Is it really love? 7 Ways to Tell Love is the most essential element of marriage. In order to differentiate lust and love watch this video until the end. In Amnon's story in the Bible, 2 Samuel chapter 23-1-6 Ammon and Tamar In the course of time, Ammon son of David fell in love with Tamar, the beautiful sister of Absalom son of David. Ammon became so obsessed with his sister Tamar that he made himself ill. She was a virgin, and it seemed impossible for him to do anything to her. Now Ammon had an advisor named Jonadab son of Shemaiah, David's brother. Jonadab was a very shrewd man. He asked Ammon, why do you, the king's son, look so haggard morning after morning? Won't you tell me? Ammon said to him, I'm in love with Tamar, my brother Absalom's sister. Go to bed and pretend to be ill, Jonadab said. When your father comes to see you, say to him, I would like my sister Tamar to come and give me something to eat. Let her prepare the food in my sight so I may watch her and then eat it from her hand. So Ammon lay down and pretended to be ill. When the king came to see him, Ammon said to him, I would like my sister Tamar to come and make some special bread in my sight, so I may eat from her hand. The big question? Is it really love? Young people not yet married need to know. Couples already married also need to know. Number 1. Adam's Counterfeit for Love. 1 John chapter 2 verse 16 For everything in the world, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life, comes not from the Father but from the world. Lust. 7 Contrasts. How to know the difference? Number 2, and contrast number 1 Lust is a changeable feeling. Love is an enduring principle. Love never fails 1 Cor 13-8. Love is a feeling you feel when you feel that you're going to get a feeling that you never felt before. That's not love. It's a principle. Love has feelings, but it's not just a feeling. We love with our hearts, but more so with our heads. 3. Contrast number 2 Passion is blind, love sees and examines. Having eyes, do you not see? Mark chapter 8 verse 18. Blind Cupid, the Roman god love. Love isn't blind, it has eyes. It seems and examines. 4. Contrast number 3 Lust is obsessed with externals. Love is concerned with the internals. Externals. Fashion. Sex appeal. Internals, personality, habits, character. 1 Samuel chapter 16 verse 7 Man looks at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. 5. Contrast number 4 Passion is promiscuous, love is pure. Let's continue Amnon's story 2 Samuel chapter 13 verses 10 to 15 Then Ammon said to Tamar, Bring the food here into my bedroom so I may eat from your hand. And Tamar took the bread she had prepared and brought it to her brother Ammon in his bedroom. 11 But when she took it to him to eat, he grabbed her and said, Come to bed with me, my sister. 12 No, my brother, she said to him. Don't force me. Such a thing should not be done in Israel. Don't do this wicked thing. 13 What about me? Where could I get rid of my disgrace? And what about you? You would be like one of the wicked fools in Israel. Please speak to the king, he will not keep me from being married to you. 14 But he refused to listen to her, and since he was stronger than she, he raped her. 15 Then Ammon hated her with intense hatred. In fact, he hated her more than he had loved her. Ammon said to her, get up and get out. When tempted with premarital sex, love says, wait tea until we get married. When invited to extramarital affairs, love says, no. I'm already married. When tempted to non-marital sex, love says, stop. Let's get married. Let's get married. 6. Contrast number 5 Lust is self-centered, love is sacrificing. Love, does not seem its own 1 Corinthians chapter 13 verses 4, 5. Lust's concern. What I want. Love's concern, what you want. 7. Contrast number 6 Passion operates by chance, love operates by divine design. In all your ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct your paths. Proverbs chapter 3 verse 6. God has a plan for my life Jeremiah chapter 29 verse 11. 8. 
And contrast number 7 lust comes from Satan, lo comes from God. 1 John chapter 4 verse 8, He who does not love does not know God, for God is love. All true love comes from God, and is comfortable in the presence of God. Author Lust Satan Author of Love Jesus. True love comes from heaven. According to these seven standards, how do I honestly rate my love? If I am not married, and my score is low, I should. If I am married and have a low score, what should I do? How can I improve my love life? Step 1 Experience the precious love of Jesus Greater love has no one than this, than to lay down one's life for his friends. John chapter 15 verse 13. The world's greater lover is Christ. Romans chapter 5 verse 8 While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. It was Thursday night. Jesus is kneeling in the garden of Gethsemane, and being in agony, he prayed more earnestly. Then his sweat became like great drops of blood falling down to the ground. Luke chapter 22 verse 44. Satan whispered. Judas will betray you. Peter will deny you. All will forsake you. Men will spit on you. Go back to heaven. And he could have gone back. Wrestling with that decision, Jesus Christ became like great drops of blood. But, looking down the centuries of time, Jesus saw you and me. He said, I'll go on to Calvary. What a love. Then Jesus Christ climbed Golgotha's hill and they nailed him to the tree. Luke chapter 23 verse 33 And when they had come to the place called Calvary, there they crucified him. Then Jesus felt himself drifting. Drifting. Farther and farther away from God. My God, my God why have you forsaken me? What love. What matchless love. Do you love him? Step 2. Surrender to the love of Jesus Jesus asked Peter three times. Do you love M. John chapter 21 verses 15 to 17. Today, Jesus asks you the same question, do you really love me? Is it really love? 2 Cor 5 14, 15, He died for all, that those who live should live no longer for themselves, but for him who died for them. Because Jesus loves me, he gave his life for me. Because I love Jesus, I'm giving my life to him. All to Jesus I surrender. Step 3 Love my spouse as Christ loves me. This is my commandment that you lobe one another as I have loved you. John chapter 15 verse 12 Love my spouse as Christ loves me. Corinthians 13 to 4 minus 8 New International Version NIV 4 Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. 5 It does not dishonor others, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. 6 Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. 7 It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. 8 Love never fails. But where there are prophecies, they will cease, where there are tongues, they will be stilled, where there is knowledge, it will pass away. Our next topic is, 3 Essentials to Successful Communication Don't forget to share, like and subscribe for more Happy Family Life videos. Thanks for watching.